Hey guys, Yukon Jacob here. This video is the Minecraft be Beta 1.5 underscore 01 Pistons Mod Installation Tutorial. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to install the Pistons Mod for 1.5 underscore 01 Minecraft Beta and how to craft a piston. How you craft a piston, I'm just going to tell you now, since I won't show you necessarily. Is what you what you do for it is you put with the crafting bench a workbench. You have a workbench. The bottom three squares you put a iron ingot, and then the middle left wall of it you put an iron ingot and the same thing for the right side middle and then at the very top middle and then in the middle you put a redstone and that's a piston Sorry about that, guys. I just wanted to... Right now, I wanted to leave this up for a little while, so it will fully... Um, so I can uh, put that as an uh, image for... For it. Okay, first of all, you want to go to the Minecraft uh, wiki, or uh, forums, rather, and the Pistons mod here, and you can push... Not now, uh, 1.5 I'll put the uh, in the description. I haven't actually updated mine yet, so I'm going to be doing that too. Okay, so first of all, you click the download button, which it will bring you to Mediafire, I believe. Yeah, Mediafire. And you also want... don't need this anymore, so... Oh, well, actually... Sorry. <clears throat> um, I'm going to upload on the new tab also. Let me close out all the other tabs, though. I have Twitter and YouTube open. And this is this is the recipe. Uh, let me bring it up. It's a... Uh, one second. Let the page load. Um, well, and I'll show you how to install it in a little bit. different in this video blah 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 okay if I have time at the end I'll show you it if I can't no it's right here okay that's the crafting bench iron ingot iron ingot iron ingot iron ingot iron ingot that's redstone right there like I was saying okay first of all what I'm gonna download first you don't have to download this first but I know how to download this. I'm not going to read any of that. Okay. <clears throat> this. I'm not going to go to that one. The fly. I'm going to go to download direct. And then this is the mod loader. 
don't need this page anymore. I And then what you want to do is go to the run. I'm using Windows 7. So you can go to run on um uh, what's it called? Uh, Windows XP. I'm not sure about Mac though. So first of all, you go to um, percent sign percent app data percent press enter and then it'll bring you up at the this page go to mine dot minecraft folder and if you go to bin and then go to the minecraft dot the minecraft jar open it up with in my case winrar i think you can use win7 but I like using WinRAR. So, first of what you want to do is do this, and then, okay, this is what you do. You take all the stuff in from this, and put it in, ah, uh, right, I have to extract this folder. To, let's, oh, let's make a new folder. And... Name it Piston Mod Needs. Piston Needs. When it loads. Okay. Piston Needs. Sorry if it's a laggy, but, you know, my computer. Pistor. That's what it looked like, but it's not, so. Okay, sorry. Put this here. If it would load. Okay, good. That's hopefully it worked. And I'll have to go back to that. Yeah, uh, my background is um, Assassin's Creed Brothers. It's my favorite game. One of them, anyway. I have a couple favorite games. My, my newest fam favorite game is uh, Homefront, though. So, yeah. <sighs> okay, so then... Once you extract it into a different folder, since I'm not sure if you can do that on Windows XP without extracting, but on Windows 7 you need to extract it first. And then you just drag it in here, let it load, we'll press OK, then let it load. Once it unpacks, basically. Okay, that's good. It's really simple installing this, actually. But it gets kind of confusing sometimes. You download it. I mean, no, I don't want to go to that. And then it brings up an advertisement. What you do with that advertisement is close it. And same thing with this real estate ad. Because I don't want to buy a house. <laughs> okay, so you open up the Pistons mod also. The folder, Pistons mod folder, if it will actually load, will it open for me? Or is it just being retarded? Okay, there we go. That's open. This, I'm going to need to extract to this folder again. What I do usually is just delete everything that's been there. And I'm, I'm going to delete the folder at the end. Because it's just taking up so much room and, you know, you know space. But out of all the stuff I have, <sighs> it's a lot. So let me do that. What? What? What did I just do? Did I just... Oh, I just deleted what's in that folder. Oh, okay, I thought I just deleted that Pistons folder here. What's... I'm sorry, guys. Okay. This is good. Now what easily you have to do is just... Move that there. Drag that there, too. All in the Minecraft jar. And I'll link WinRAR also, if I remember. Okay, and then finally you delete the meta inf folder. You press the... simple way is press the delete button. But it's not working for me. No, I don't want to delete the name. Uh, yeah, I just go to delete up here. If you need to, anyway. Deleting, let it delete. <sighs> I 
you have to let it delete because uh, it's uh, it's some I, I'm not sure exactly why, but you just have to let it do this. It may take like a minute or so, and then. If it loads. And then after this, what we're going to do is open up Minecraft. So, let me just, uh, sorry, let me just quickly check YouTube. My messages, I believe it's done. Is it done, or do I have to wait a little bit longer? Okay, it's done. Whoa, lag. Okay, you can close the WinRAR, or whatever program you're using, no messages. And then you can go in ahead and open up Minecraft. Minecraft load. It's taking a little bit longer than usual because I am recording. You can close this folder too here. Blah blah blah. You know the drill if you own Minecraft anyway. Log into Minecraft. I don't know why you'd be watching this if you don't own Minecraft though. <coughs> so let me single player and uh, let me go down to my piston aisles save let it load let it load let it load and I don't have redstone but I will. I, I I can make a piston right now. Just I need a workbench. Whoa, lag. Change the render distance. Okay, so where's the spawn? Huh. Ah, eh, whatever. Let me just... Here we go. Uh, oh, I have a lot of leather because I was trying to make um, seeing if there was um, a special like a um, hidden thing that like a hidden recipe for um, a saddle. This is what you do. You put it right there. You put this there. You put that there. You put that. Bam, bam, and bam. And guess what? You got a piston. Whoa, lag. Mm, you can activate the piston by doing this. And, well, it would actually help if the redstone was directly connected to that. Okay, 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 okay. Let me... See? Okay, guys. Um, yeah, this is a, this was a, a tutorial on how to install the Pistons mod, and I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and learned from it. Thank you for watching, and as always, till next time, guys.